For this recording, I will show you how to do 2009 MST question 4B. Given a plane x plus y plus z equal to 0, find the parametric equation of the line. And this line is perpendicular to the plane and passes through the point 1, 2, 3. So, we are going to find the main thing is the equation of the line. So, we are referring to equation of a line. Now, to do this, you must recall how to find equation of a line. If you refer to our entrance on equation of a line, it says that if you have a point in a three-dimensional space, and the point in three-dimensional space, let's say, is x0, y0, z0, and you have a line, and this line passes through this point, and the line is parallel to a vector v, which is ai plus bj plus dk, then the parametric equation had this form, x equal to x0 plus at, y equal to y0 plus bt, z equal to z0 plus ct, where x0 y0 and z0 are coming from the point, and a, b, c are coming from the normal, or vector, a vector that is parallel to the line, and the t is the parameter in this case, right? t parameter. And this equation is called a parametric equation of the line. So from here, we are ready now to work out the and solution for question 4b. So we have a plane x plus y plus z equals 0 and the normal to the plane. In this case, it will refer to part A. We know that the normal to the plane is i plus j plus k by part A of this question. And we have a line and this line here is parallel to this normal vector. Why is it parallel to this normal vector here? Because the line is perpendicular to the plane. The uh, perpendicular to the plane is parallel to N now. Alright? So we can say that L is parallel to N, which is I plus J plus K. That means A is equal to 1, B equal to 1, C equal to 1, 1I, one 1J, one 1K. One and in this case, the line passes through 1, 2, 3. So the equation of the line in this case is x equal to x0 plus AT y equal to y0 plus bt, z equal to z0 plus ct, and y is my x0, y0, z0. So in this case, my x0, y0, z0 is a point it pass through, which is 1, 2, 3. So this means x equal to 1 plus a t. What is a now? a in this case is 1. So 1 plus 1t. And y is equal to y0 plus bt. And where is b now? b is equal to 1. Alright. And so this is y equal to y0 is 2. Uh, so 2 plus t. b is 1 here. And z equals z0 plus ct, where is z0? z0 is 3 here, so this is 3 plus c. c is what? c in this case is the number here. The line is parallel to i plus j plus k, so c is equal to 1, so this is equal to 1 times t, again t again. So this is called the parametric equation of the line. So, in short, what is the mean take away now? So, the mean take away, key take away.
parametric equation of a line. Of a line L passes through x the law, y the law, z the law, and parallel to a i b j c k is x equal to x the law plus a t y equal to y the law plus b t z equal to z the law plus c t. Alright, so we get line L here passing through a point x the law, y the law, z the law, and parallel to a vector. This vector is V. A, I, B, J, C, K. So, for this particular case, what you will need is to figure out what is the direction of the line here, which is V. And in for this particular case, the line is perpendicular to the plane. When the line is perpendicular to a plane, means the line is parallel to the normal to the plane. As the normal is perpendicular to the plane. So that complete the solution for question 4B. And the key takeaway is this result.